Hi guys, ladies and gentlemen, this is Rusty78609 in Central Texas, USA, and this is Mail Call! <laughs> Make me hoarse. <coughs> oh. Yes, believe it or don't, the moth was gone today and I got one letter, so PJ can make fun of my one letter mail call. Fall in! Off those bunks, on your feet, fall in for mail call. One of you. <laughs> Just one of you, the rest of you can go wherever the hell you want to. <laughs> anyway guys, this is the envelope, and it comes from Tess in Indiana, Indianapolis, Indiana. And I'll show you the deal in just a minute. I got to hear that. There's something in there, wasn't it? Anyway, I'll cover the address and then I'll show you. She's got some pretty stamps on the front. She's got, let's see, who is that? Jim Bridger, Native American culture. Home on the Range, and Jimi Hendrix. Oh, Jimmy, get down, Jimmy. Say, yeah. But anyway, I got it right here. And on the back, there's a, a whale, a panda, and a tiger. See that? So thank you, Tess. You decorated the envelope, envelope quite well. Thank you. Then this is what's called a letter. And I'll read it to you. <laughs> Had it upside down. I probably could have read it that way anyway, but I decided not to. Anyway, it's dated February the 3rd, 2018, and this is the 10th. It took a while to get here. Well, of course, I didn't check the mail yesterday. So, but anyway, it says, Hi, Rusty. And it's printed perfectly. She's got good printing. Good printing. Yeah, I can show you that, I think. See? The printing is very, very legible, okay? It says, Hi, Rusty. I wanted to send you something to make you smile. Oops, my hand out of the way. My giant hand. <clears throat> I wanted to send you something to make you smile at mail call, but I don't want to clutter up your 16-foot trailer with, with expensive gifts or cards smiling face so enclosed are five granny isms just in case you run out of things to talk about you can refer to these these bottle caps are recycled recycled and recyclable no need to save them in the bucket of honor just take them to the full moon recycled dumpster yeah that's what i call it because it's only there on a full moon Keep up the good work, and thanks for the laughs. Sincerely, Tess. Thank you, Tess. Now, to read the granny-isms, I will read them in random order. They are in no... Let me shake them up. This gets the evil spirits away. Wish I had some smoke. See, if I had some smoke, I could take over the planet. Okay, here we go. At no, in no order. This is a granny -ism. Oh, these are also sweet leaf iced tea lids, caps. And it says homemade goodness, homemade goodness, homemade goodness. It says homemade goodness. And this is granny -ism number 56, according to this. Luck is when preparation meets opportunity. Dun 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 dun. Grannyism number 56. Grannyism number 12. There's only five of them. Grannyism number 12. Always wear clean underpants. <laughs> and be careful, you old guys. Just when you thought you had to pass a little gas, it might surprise you. So, grannyism number 41. You are what you drink. Sweet leaf tea. That's what I am. And beer. And here is grannyism number 28. Don't cross your eyes. They'll stick. You know, I was actually told that when I was growing up. 
because we used to take our finger and, and look at it, you know, and then that'll cross your eyes. And I remember people say, or the old timers saying, don't do that, they'll, they'll, they'll stick. And I actually believed it. I still believe it. Don't cross your eyes, they'll stick. Grannyism, that's grannyism number 28. So they're not in any, I've only got five. Uh, anyway, grannyism number 48, wisdom comes with age. Yes, because after you have made every freaking mistake that can be made, people say you're wise. I mean, what's left of you, what's left of you is wise. The rest of you is dead, okay? Anyway, thank you very much, Tess, for your sweet leaf iced Tea, granny isms. I sincerely appreciate that. Oh, I could do this. Anyway, I better put them down or I'll be doing that all afternoon. Anyway, having said that, guys, from Central Texas, USA, this is Rusty78609. I'm not through yet. I know that. What we have here is what used to be an ordinary bucket used to ice down hello beer when I did wine and beer tasting events I used this no I didn't use this can I used another one somebody sent me this one but anyway but now we have moved it up to being the bucket of honor It is now an honored bucket so that anything you put into it is honored also okay so what we have here is the letter and stamps and stuff from Tess in Indiana and so Tess's letter goes in there and now it is an honored letter in the bucket of honor okay so now I put the bucket of honor over here to get it out of my way and then I take these lids <laughs> you know all you need to do be you know when if you were a medicine man all you had to do was have, have something that smoked that was one or smoke you know what I mean and something that made a lot of noise because people are attracted to noises and, and there's certain churches that do that too they've got bells and gongs and crap and all of that is that ritual is what you what you get addicted to okay because uh, you know you can train a, a dog by being uh, predictable you know about doing the same thing over and over and over and we we think we're different we ain't <laughs> we, we, we you you get a dinner bell and you ring it, I guarantee you, you do it enough, and pretty soon when you ring that dinner bell, you won't have to call anybody. They'll come right on in. But anyway, having said that, thank you very much, Tess from Indianapolis. Oh, I gotta put the gotta put this in. I forgot the letter. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine that? I'd take my cowboy hat and go down to Marvel Art Station. Because when a Texan fancies, he'll take his chances, chances will be taken. But anyway, having said that, guys, in a co it's getting colder here. Right now it's 48 degrees, and the wind's out of the north. We're supposed to be about 30 tonight. High tomorrow is about 41 or 42. And then after that, woo, here we go, baby, riding that roller coaster right on into the toasting summer. But anyway, for anyway, 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 anyway. Uh, for you guys in the up north, uh, believe it or not, it'll get warmer up there too. So having said that, hey Google, what's the temperature in, in uh, Alamogordo, New Mexico? The temperature in Alamogordo right now is 67. 67. It's 27 degrees warmer there than it is here. That's not fair. That is not fair. Anyway, uh, I have found some more places to go camping too. I did. I found two more. But anyway, I won't tell you about them until I get there and look at them because they might be a zero. But anyway, anyway, anyway. Thumbs up, Carpe Diem, adios, bye, bye, bye. Anything your little heart desires. But if you choose, use the link to Amazon products in the description of my videos. Why? Because I'm an Amazon affiliate and I get a small commission and it does not cost you one dime. It's a freebie, 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 freebie if you choose to do it. If it's too inconvenient, don't worry about it. Ain't no problem. And for those of you that have, boom, ba -da -dum, boom, 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 I appreciate it very much, very much, very much. And what else? Uh, drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day will not hurt you. It's actually good for you. It will help you avoid gout. That's gout. Uh, kidney stones. Mm, kidney stones. And it will help you lose weight because you'll be full of water. What else? Take deep breaths. Deep. 
hold it for a few seconds and then breathe out slowly. Why? Because that, that lowers your stress, which lowers your blood pressure, which is really good for you and everybody knows that because high blood pressure is a problem all over the world. What else? Uh, stretch, 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 walk, walk, walk. I did my stretches and walking. I took a good walk this morning, did my stretches. I'll do my stretches again here in just a little bit, but I won't walk anymore because the wind's out of the north and it's 48 degrees outside. And when the wind's blowing, the wind makes all the difference, as you know. But anyway, enjoy your day. Thank you, Tess, again for the, the, for the, uh, for the granny-isms, and uh, I appreciate it. And you have a good day. Y'all have a good day. Have a good weekend. This is Saturday, uh, February the 10th, I think. So anyway, enjoy your day, guys. Adios, amigos. Bye-bye.